हेलो एंड नमस्ते एवरीवन वेलकम टू माय चैनल डीआईवाई विद जिनी आई पोस्ट क्राफ्टी डीआईवाई वीडियोस हियर सो इफ यू लाइक क्रिएटिंग स्टफ ऑन योर ओन देन कंसीडर सब्सक्राइबिंग इन दिस वीडियो आई एम शेयरिंग हाउ टू मेक डीआईवाई क्रिएटिव गिफ्ट्स फॉर योर मम ऑन अपकमिंग मदर्स डे यू कैन आल्सो यूज दिस आइडियाज एज अ बर्थडे गिफ्ट फॉर योर मम दिस इज पार्ट टू ऑफ मदर्स डे गिफ्ट सीरीज सो इफ यू हैवेंट वॉच पार्ट वन ऑफ दिस सीरीज देन प्लीज चेक इट आउट Now go get your crafting supplies and let's get started. For first DIY, you will need to take a walk in nature and gather some beautiful flowers and leaves. Now bring that to your crafting space. Next Place these florals in a notebook. Then close the notebook and place something heavy on top and then keep it aside to dry for at least 2 to 3 days. And you will get the super beautiful pressed flowers next take a clear glass cup then you will need mod podge or any other clear glue now apply a thin layer of mod podge inside the cup and then stick pressed flowers and leaves from inside You can check positions of flowers and shuffle them if needed till the glue is still wet. Then keep it aside to dry overnight. Once it's dry then it will look something like this. As you can see some flowers have changed the colors here but still it's looking very pretty so let's go ahead and make candle. For that you will need a melting pot. Then some candle wax. You can also reuse wax from old candles. Next, I am adding a wax crayon to make a white candle. Then, melt the wax using microwave or double boiler method. And while it's melting, let's stick the wick to the bottom of the cup using some hot glue. Now add any essential oil of your choice to make aroma candle. Now stir that properly and then carefully pour this melted wax into the cup. Secure the wick up straight using some popsicle sticks and then keep it aside to settle. cut the excess wick and your super beautiful nature inspired aroma candle is ready this candle is not only a great gift idea but also a unique and creative home decor piece i'm totally in love with this candle If you enjoyed this content so far then please hit like share this video with your friends and family and subscribe to this channel for more such videos Now let's hop on to our second DIY gift idea
there is no other useful gift than a protective mask in current situation. So I ordered some cotton reusable masks for Amazon which came with this beautiful cotton bag. For this video, I am using this white double layer cotton fabric mask which have a very great quality. I will provide links to the products that I am using in this video in the description box down below. So please check it out. Next, you will need fabric paints. I used a lot of white fabric paint to make pastel shade for each color. Now let's start coloring. I am painting some random blobs here. I am making a matching mask to the mobile phone case I painted earlier in the part 1 of Mother's Day gift idea video. Link for the same is provided in the description box down below. Here, I am drawing some abstract shapes using black fabric paint. Once you are happy with the design, then let it dry completely. And then, iron on the back side of the mask. Now let's make matching sanitizer bottle. For this, you will need a spray bottle. Then apply masking tape on both ends. Now apply a layer of white gesso on bottle. If you don't have gesso, then you can use acrylic paint here. Now repeat the same process of random colorful blobs and abstract black shapes. Now remove the masking tape and add a layer of Mod Podge on top to prevent paint from chipping. And this super beautiful trio of mask, sanitizer bottle and matching mobile phone case cover is ready. Now to wrap this gift, I used the same cotton bag which came with the mask. I'm sure your mom would love to receive this gift. Now let's hop on to our last DIY gift idea. To make this DIY, you will need a decorative chalkboard. I purchased mine from Amazon. Then grab any twine. Next, I will be using these super pretty flowers from Little Birdie. Next, I will be using some embellishments from my stash.
Now stick everything like I'm showing here using hot glue. If you use hot glue very often, then this silicone finger protector is a blessing. And this super cute chalkboard hanging sign is ready. This is a great gift idea because you can personalize it with pictures or messages. And it's a must have thing in any mom's kitchen. If you recreate any of these DIYs, then please share pictures with me on Instagram with hashtag DIYWithCine. I would love to see them. Also, if you have any ideas or suggestions, then please let me know in the comment section down below. I will try my best to make that happen. Thank you so much for watching. If you enjoyed this video, then be sure to give it a big thumbs up. And don't forget to hit the subscribe button. Also click on the bell icon so that you can get notifications for my next videos. For more inspiration, I handpicked these two videos for you. Have a magical day. Happy crafting.